It's gotten over 40,000 views so far on Facebook, including Syracuse's mayor issuing a statement about the incident tonight. And now a controversial video of an eight-year-old being put in the back of a Syracuse police cruiser and officers' actions are being viewed by the department. Just outside of a corner store, drawing all the attention at a bystander's cell phone camera, police leading an eight-year-old boy to a police car. He's accused of stealing a bag of chips. He's sobbing. People watching are shouting at police to leave the boy alone. This is only a portion of the video. It's filled with expletives. Syracuse police say the child was never arrested, never put in handcuffs, only placed in the back of the patrol car to take him to his father, who they met with. No charges were filed. Syracuse's mayor saying the officer knew the child from prior interactions and explained to him that he was being taken home. Just this week, our conversation with the mayor touched on the complexity of troubled kids, crime, and interactions with police. We do need to make investments and are making investments that are more proactive in nature, that are trying to uh, engage particularly young people uh, that, are, uh, that are headed in the wrong direction um, and, and try to get them pointed in the right direction. And in this case, will lead to more discussions. In the mayor's words, what occurred demonstrates the continuing need for the city to provide support to our children and families and to invest in alternative response options to assist our officers. Now, all three officers seen in that video, they were all wearing body cameras, and that footage is going to be reviewed. The officers will remain on duty while that's being done.